Hello! Welcome, Welcome to, to our, our magical, magical journal. journal! Happy holidays! We are back and into the groove. We've already gone through the holidays, of course, so this is the first kind of week that we're getting back. What is the quote for this week, Addison? The quote for this week is, um, you must not let anyone define your limits because of where you are from. You, your only limit is your soul, right? And, and that, mo that movie is, that Disney movie is Ratatouille. Ratatouille, it's from Ratatouille. What does that mean? It means that your only limit is your soul. I do not know. So basically what that means is the only person that gets in the way of succeeding and you guys being able to do things, do hard things, and do things that you think are impossible is you. That's the only person that would get in the way is you saying that you can't do something. Mm -hmm. So your only limit is yourself. So you can't let any anybody define your limits. You can't let anybody tell you that you can't do something. And if they do, ignore them and go on and prove them wrong, right? Right. Okay. So, uh, we're going to start out with Mom. Her topic, I ended up doing the history, more of the history on of tea than I did the coffee. But I did both. But I'm just going to present... Um, we, we're going to try something new this week. We're just going to present three facts from each topic and show you a picture and then kind of shorten it up because we have learned more. Keep in mind, we've learned more than what we're presenting on, but that way you guys aren't watching a 15 minute, 20 minute long movie. The Japanese shifted the matcha style tea, tea which was a powder that was grounded down and put into boiling tea to the loose leaf tea that we drink today. So the Ming Dynasty is responsible for changing that. And that's a lot of what I drink. So that's from like Japan. Tea originated from China. Um, I didn't know that. I wasn't sure if it was China or Japan, but it actually was originated from China. Um, and then also tea uh, today is the second most consumed beverage after water. Um, and then the only fact that I have on coffee, I, I did study the history of it, but coffee, I, I found out that coffee is, used to be illegal. They used to actually treat it as alcohol because they said, you know, it was, it was of the devil because it, it had an effect. You know, caffeine has an effect on us. It stimulates you. It keeps you awake whenever you're tired and such. So they, they did try to... Um, make it illegal. This was back, you know, whenever, I don't remember what time it was. It was like back, I gotta think, it was, I want to say it was 1700s maybe. I may be wrong. Um, it may be before that, maybe in the 1500s even. But I, I didn't write anything down, so I'm not, I'm not. And, quite... um, my topic today is um, trees. Yep, your topic is, it's, it's, you, um, yep, you wanted to study the trees of Georgia, but you ended up studying just kind of trees yeah, and, and this how they work. I'm going to show you um, a purple one. What, which one? It's, this one? It's, so what continent is that that you're pointing to? Um, well, think about it. We got North America and then... South America. So that purple tree is in South America. And my other favorite one is. Um, oh, and what kind of what kind of tree is it? Let's see. Let's show them. It is a jacaranda tree. You see that? They tell you what kind of tree it is. Yeah, but jacaranda tree. My, my other okay. favorite one is like I like these because they look like Christmas trees. You got any? Those are probably like pine trees. Right? And you also you like the yellow trees too. Okay. Cool. Did you notice me me and sis on sis's topic, did you notice that tree? Do you know what kind of tree that is? Mm -hmm. Did you notice that, that tree is on your picture that you did for your presentation? Yeah. Do you see that? Yeah, just don't, so that don't is, tell them what my topic is. That is 
Bobob, I guess. That right there is Bobob and the island of Madagascar. And it's also in Africa. And they have like this tree because like there's different like wow. different ones coming up. Like the the trees and um, they get their water they get their water from the dirt. Okay. And they get the sun from that that goes on to their leaves. Goes on they, to their leaves. It doesn't look like they get it from the the dirt. They don't get it from the dirt. They no. get it from from like sunlight. And um, I haven't. What is that process called? Um, it's called photosynthesis. Say it louder. Photosynthesis. Photosynthesis. And, and what do they do with the sun and the water? They use it to make what? Um, energy. Which is what? Food, right? They make their own food. So um, like the middle of um a tree trunk, it and like whenever it's cut off, it turns into Some rocks. Rings. It's rings and it turns into a rock. Well, eventually, eventually. It, it becomes petrified, doesn't it? Petrified. Uh huh. It's mushrooms have roots. Mushrooms have roots, and and do they are they on trees sometimes too? Yes. They do. They grow differently on trees, don't they? Yeah, they do. Okay, y'all done? Yes. Go ahead. Hello, my name is Addison, and my topic. It's not rodents, it's Madagascar. Madagascar. And today, book. Okay. Beavers and other rodents. Okay. And my favorite rodent that was interesting in here is this little guy right here. It's so cute. What is it? It's a flying squirrel. A flying squirrel. Do flying squirrels live in Madagascar? It says most flying squirrels live in Asia, but some live in North America. But uh, I know it was just an interesting So thing. it was just something interesting to you that you wanted to show a picture of. Mm -hmm. So flying squirrels there. An interesting one about the mountains. Dragon's bird <laughs> mountains means dragon mountains. Hmm. The, and that's the, that's at Madagascar, huh? Yeah. Cool. It's kind of like at Africa. Mm-hmm. And I also learned about the flying squirrel. Okay, tell us a fact about the flying squirrel. Flying squirrels don't fly the way birds fly. Cool. So they can, they can fly like, they can't, they can't fly higher than where they started. Okay, cool. Blue canes are only found in South Africa. Oh, blue cranes? Mm -hmm, blue My canes. favorite. We'll have to include a picture of it and in there. Just in case you didn't know, pandas are a type of bear. Wow, pandas beavers. are a type of bear. Baby beavers are called kids or pups before baby beavers are even born. The other family members get the lodge ready. Lodge? Homes. Mm -hmm. The mother carries her babies inside her body for three months. Go ahead. What did, what did you, you learn this week? Tell us in the comments. Bye! Bye.